नमस्ते बिलेवेड um let us sit together right now but in a different way i invite you to sit with me right now but uh, be prepared that this is not going to be a silent sitting or just sitting in a normal sense i want to more have have sort of a look within ourselves i want uh, together i want uh, i want that let us let us have a look together within ourselves it's not going to be same for everyone so let us begin now okay eyes closed or eyes open is totally fine but more relaxed and focused within ourselves you know like more focused within ourselves that is there something i have to attend right now is there something important that i have to attend not that immediately jumping on it that okay any thought that comes that is what i have to attend no being very stable observer or analyzer of it like analyzing without without thinking so much into it but more observing that okay is there something that i have to do right now very simple about it because if you have to do something about something it will come to you you don't have to go to it so we don't have to go into the mind or thinking or feelings or anything like is it fine for you to just uh, just just enjoy being how you are right now is anything bothering you is anything anything engaging you we are just trying to bring it into the light of our own seeing right now that's all and we will keep it in the light of our own seeing not trying to solve it but trying to only see it but i hope you you understand my 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 pointing right now i think most of you if not everybody understood it so it's not about uh, um, being in a special state no being in exact same state where we are feeling the same things which we are feeling seeing the same things which we are seeing inside it is all about inside only not outside but it's about looking at everything in a more stable stable manner not everything in the sense that what is what but in the sense that is there anything inside me which is engaging me so this time we are not checking that whether i am engaged with anything or not or we are not trying to withdraw ourselves from engagement we are now scanning that am i engaged with something or is am, do i want to be engaged with something is there something pulling me or engaging me do not go there don't be pulled into it just acknowledge and try to sense what it is let us try to live in the light of our own being our own truth what it is so there are few facts about this what we are doing one is that you are present you are not going anywhere you are you are not trying to be present 
you are only simply present. And now seeing or scanning anything which which is kind of you know engaging us or trying to pull us in any way, trying to get us out of this this uh, place of being where we are. Like like as you are present, also we can use like is there something engaging you and making you less present? than you are right now this also can be used as a pointer as a as a you know way of understanding and let us remain open about it let us not declare that no there is nothing which is bothering me or there is nothing which is trying to pull me into engagement A very simple scanning, but it is a scanning done by the being that we are, by the truth that we are. All we are doing is that we are bringing the light of our own seeing into our inner space in which things happen, feelings happen, thoughts happen and our engagement with them also happens. So right now we are just trying to actually experience or see clearly what I am engaged with if there is some engagement and what exactly is engagement. We are trying to know the nature of engagement nature of what I am engaged with, if there is anything. Only nature of it, like a sample. We are not really working on something. So we are not looking for thoughts or feelings or anything. We are not trying to watch our thoughts or watch our feelings. No, we are looking at something very simple and fundamental. Engagement. Am I engaged with something right now? And using this question as a scanner, a scanning within And uh, this uh, questioning, this conscious questioning is going to uh, highlight our unconscious engagements and uh, is going to make us free from it for, for this moment. So in this moment we will become free from unconscious engagements. Whenever uh, you feel any stress, relax, meaning stop making that effort. And then again, when you feel fine, then check, then check again. Because there is no place for stress here so much. Meaning stress can be felt in the body-mind a little bit, but are you stressed or are you excited to, to engage in this exploration? being more simple about the fact that uh, there are things uh, inside me <coughs> and more importantly there is an engagement I, I am engaged sometime right now I am only present and scanning uh, internally using my own um, awareness 
that am I engaged with something? It's not about what I am engaged with, that's less important. But am I engaged with something? And this is not really going to maybe give us so much of glimpse of things, but it's going to give us freedom from engagement with them. Because our engagements are unconscious engagements. Our consciousness towards it will make us free for right now. And uh, through this guiding so far, we have become sufficiently free now from engagement. We have become sufficiently free from unconscious engagements with our energies of body-mind. I want to attempt today uh, to, to, to live our truth right now. It's a good time, I feel. Let us uh, now use the same power of scanning or awareness to wonder what is my nature. What is, in Hindi we say, Swaroop, no? Satya Swaroop. What is my true nature? Now, myself, who is present and more or less free from engagement with everything that is inside. What is my nature? It is about living uh, my nature, it is about living our nature, feeling our nature, sensing our nature in the light of our own awareness. This is not self-inquiry, this is self-wonder. The self that you are wonders, is wondering right now. Who, what is my nature, who I am, who is present, not engaged, only present? So if my sharing invites you to get engaged then then something is not understood well i am not trying to engage you into self inquiry i am trying to inspire you into self wonder self wonder is not a activity it is the self that you are wonder wonders wonder is not a activity when the wonder reaches in the mind, then it becomes the activity of thinking and all. But right now it is not. It is limited or it is confined within the self that you are, the wonder. Living our nature. What is my nature? Not searching for our nature anywhere. You are your nature. Who you are, who is, who is present, who is not engaged, this you. You live your own self in the light of your own awareness. Live, sense, feel. Any, any, any way that works, engage with yourself, but not as an activity, but through the wonder.
uh, in f a few minutes uh, we will end this this session that time you can invite uh, you can you can open open your eyes But right now, I want to wonder with you for the last time in during this guiding. Uh, are your eyes closed or open right now? While your physical eyes are closed, while your physical eyes are closed, uh, are your eyes closed really internally? Is awareness not your own eyes? And is it closed or open? Is there an option that your self-awareness or your awareness from the self can be closed or open? Is there an option? Is it not just simply always on? Yes, it is. The, the awareness from the self is always on. It is just a matter of where to use it. We are using it onto itself. This is light unto itself. The light of awareness falling onto its own own self, its own source, who that we are. This is what we are. No? We are the self uh, emitting the light of awareness. And now using that same light of awareness to sense, to feel, to live who we are. You can um, slowly start opening your eyes if you feel. But continue feeling yourself. Continue living, living yourself. <coughs> and the, 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 the experience through the mind and through the senses is very different when we are living from ourselves. It's very light and yeah, also it's very alive. As if there's a there's a natural detachment from everything that we are seeing. As if there is a natural freedom from everything that we are we are experiencing through the senses, through the mind, through the body, through the mind, no? Because we are avoiding in the self that we are more. We are we have come out of ourselves less. Isn't it amazing? that our eyes are open, our mind is functioning and yet we are still able to experience that coolness, that uh, soundlessness, that uh, joy of our own self, that peace of our own self. So the whole point that I'm trying to trying to make here is that 
how to withdraw our self from body mind into our own being sufficiently only necessary awareness remains in the body mind rest comes back and abides in the source producing a joy producing a joyful self knowing you know this this awareness when withdrawn from the mind and body the excessive awareness and uh, res- residing in the in the source in the self is creating a joyful self awareness joyful self awareness where there is no effort to feel feel ourselves there is no effort to sense ourselves rather there is, there is a joy of feeling ourselves so this self avoidance continues the key here is that when we are meditating then how much of you came out of mind into yourself the more of you come out of mind into yourself the more somehow it will become clear and possible because it is not the mind deciding how much you will reside in that it is you the self deciding and the self that we are did not have any other option before this that is there any other option where i can reside now we have another option called my own being thank you thank you